Hello you guys, welcome back to the vlogs. I'm gonna do another longer vlog because I know that you guys have been liking them. So I'm just gonna start it right off. It's actually three. I was not gonna vlog today, then decided, you know what? Stop being a baby and get out the camera. So that's what I'm doing. So if you guys are new here, hello, welcome back. My name is Bianca. Sutton is taking a nap at the moment. However, it took so long to get her to go down today. I sat down with her around like 110 and she didn't fall asleep until 220. So I don't know how long she'll be sleeping for, but I abide by the rule of never wake a sleeping baby unless absolutely necessary. And today is like not an absolutely necessary day to wake a baby. So we're just gonna let her like go. We leave for vacation in a little less than a week. A week from yesterday, we leave for my side of the family's vacation, which I'm so excited for. The past two years, we've gone on Colin's family vacation because the like, dates just didn't line up with my family's vacation. And um, Colin's sister got married over my family's vacation, so obviously I picked Colin's sister's wedding. So we just haven't been since I was pregnant with Seth. And going to my cousin's lake house in northern Minnesota, and I grew up going there, so I am so excited to take Sutton back. And Minnesota is on my list of places I would move, by the way. Colin told me the other day to give him a list of my top five places that I want us to attempt to move to, um, wherever he can get a job, God willing. And Minneapolis, Minnesota is on my list. So I love Minnesota with all my heart, and I'm so excited to go back. I'm so looking forward to this trip. So this vlog is going to be like prepping for vacation plus our celebrating our anniversary. So I got in a package from Daily Drills. This isn't the giveaway package. I'll show you guys that when it comes, um, but they sent me this stuff too, which I'm like so excited about. So they sent over this little workout set, which I'm gonna wear to F45 tonight. I've been working out after Colin gets home from work. I'll explain that in a second. Um, but anyways, they sent this little workout set, which is so cute. And then they sent this sweat set, which is gonna be so, good for Minnesota. This is definitely coming with, it's this oversized sweatshirt in sand. And I mean, it's like so perfectly oversized. I got, or I get a size large, extra large from Daily Drills because you guys know I just like my stuff to fit oversized and it's so good. And then so are the shorts. I love Daily Drills sweatshorts. So these are a different style than the, than the yellow ones that I have, but I really like these too. So Anyways, I just opened that. Madison's parents are babysitting Sutton for us on Saturday, so I need to get to this place picked up, cleaned up. You know, when you have guests coming over and you just want your house to be like absolutely impeccably spotless, that's what I want, obviously. So I want it to look like no one's lived here a day in their life. So I'm gonna be working on that as well. Anyways, I just have like a couple more things to wrap up on my computer, editing wise. And then we're gonna move on to getting stuff done before Colin gets home from work and whenever Sutton ends up waking up is when she wakes up. I already finished listening to the toast because of how long, I put her, how long it took me to put her down for a nap. So I don't have anything to listen to. Are you guys like that? I am not productive if I'm not listening to something. If I'm just sitting here with my own thoughts, I am so not productive. But if I have something going, I'm really productive. And I took a break from reading I need to start Queen of Shadow and Throne of Glass, but it's like a lot to take in and plus I love it so much. I don't want it to end. So I'm really taking my time reading and I'm kind of like going at the pace of my friends who are reading it too. And I finished before them. So now I'm waiting for them to finish before I start Queen of Shadow. But I'm just like really enjoying taking my time reading it. It is so good. I can't decide if I like this or Akotar better, but I do think I like Akotar better because of just like the more romance in it. It's just like more entertaining to read. But if you need book recommendations, like obviously this is what everybody says. I'm sorry, but are my neighbors doing something weird? Alcatar and Throne of Glass is so good. So good. I, I do like those better than Fourth Wing, by the way. Well, <laughs> as soon as I said that, she woke up like 10 minutes later, but that's fine because then she'll go to bed better tonight. She's eating just a kid's go macro bar. And also i put that cute little clip in her hair from that one pr package that i got i mean it's just the cutest are you gonna work you take over girl you pay the bills i think it's a good idea oh yeah oh yeah you have any business calls today 
I don't think we have any Zoom meetings today. Yeah, that's empty. This is what we've been up to. Can you put the colors on? Purple, right next to it. Good job, baby. What's next? Six. Yellow. Daddy's here. Yellow, good job. Gray, perfect. That's black. Brown and black are so similar though. Here, look. Look, this one's brown. I'm gonna put it over here for you. Orange, good job. What is it? What is it? Green. Green. Red. Oh, excuse Murphy. Where does red go? Nice. Purple. Purple. Good job. Purple. Black. Good job. Mommy's favorite color. Oh, is it a little bent? I can fix it. Good job! Yeah, look, now we gotta do all those. I wanted to thank today's sponsor of the video, which is BetterHelp. I have worked with BetterHelp before in the past, for like the past couple years actually, and I have been in therapy twice in my life, once when my parents got divorced and then again when Sutton was a newborn, just to make sure that I was doing good, especially being a mother and in my marriage and everything like that. I just wanted to make sure that I was good because I heard of how many girls struggle with postpartum depression. I am just such a true believer in therapy. Colin's been in therapy is a true testament. It changed his life and just so many people near and dear to my heart have struggled with mental health issues and whether it be severe or minor, it doesn't really matter. I think that your mental health is so important and I know that you guys know that if you follow my channel. Um, it's just been something I've been preaching for years and I'm so happy I get to share better help with you guys because I know I know sometimes right. Sutton singing, but I know sometimes um, therapy can just be daunting or you don't want to seem like a burden when you are just opening yourself up to your family and sometimes it just it's easier to talk to a third party person who is totally not involved in the situation and um, I'm just happy I get to share better help with you guys because I think it could be a really good option Especially if you are not a fan of in-person therapy. There's nothing wrong with wanting to seek help or just wanting to talk to somebody. I always feel so much better when I get things off of my chest and it also is just motivating. Like therapy can do so many good and positive things for you and while I'm not currently in therapy, um, I could be for how much I don't like living in Georgia. Maybe I should look back into going to see Gabby, but I've always had positive experiences. No better help wants to make sure you have a positive experience as well. So if you're unfamiliar with better help, better help connects you with a licensed therapist who is trained to listen and to give you help Full unbiased advice. So first you go to their site. So you can go to betterhelp.com slash Bianca Henderson. You just answer a few questions and then BetterHelp will match you with a professional who has years of experience with helping people who are maybe struggling with whatever you're struggling with. The best part is you can do it all from your phone or your computer. So you can do a phone call, you can do a video chat, or you can do messaging. So however you feel most comfortable communicating, you are free to do that through BetterHelp. And then you'll be matched with a therapist usually in 48 hours so they get you started quick which is great and also let's say you start talking to somebody on BetterHelp and you just don't feel like it's a right match you can switch for free and start talking to a new therapist because BetterHelp wants you to find somebody that you think fits you and your needs best which is really cool so let BetterHelp connect you with a therapist who can support you you can go to betterhelp.com slash Bianca Henderson I'll have my link in my description box below and then during your sign up you can enjoy a special discount off of your first month so again my link is betterhelp.com slash Bianca Henderson Henderson for you guys to get that discount. It's never too late to start therapy. It's never too late to take your own mental health into account. And you know, 
the worst that can happen is you decide it wasn't for you but you know you never know unless you try and that's what somebody had to tell me back when I was 18 years old and my parents were getting divorced and it really helped me out a lot and I was just not in a good place at all and I do feel like it helped so yeah anyways I'm excited um, I get to share this with you guys because you know I care about you you care about me and I just want to help or share something that I know could benefit somebody out there thank you again BetterHelp for sponsoring today's video and let's continue on with the vlog hey guys I put on my new daily drill set that they sent I was gonna wear the sweatshirt um, on top of it but I think I want to save it and keep it for our Minnesota trip just like so I don't have to wash it before but anyways, I'm just wearing my Ritzia sweatshirt. But this set is so cute. I can wash this before, but I'll definitely bring this too. All right. We have pulled up to at 45. Taking a class. I think we're just doing leftovers for dinner. So I'm like also taking an upper body and then I'll be done for the day with my energy probably. I'm like so tired today for some reason. I don't even know. <laughs> Oh my goodness, morning. I just did uh, cardio. Well, it's like cardio and strength on Fridays, but it feels like more cardio. But I just did that at 45 class, got into the morning class, but it's kind of like a weird switch up to work out. Like, I mean, I make it work because I'm limited with my options on Fridays because they don't have 6.30 classes on Friday, so I can't go after Colin gets off work. So it's like Monday's my only option. So. I mean, I could go to a different workout, but I like the Fridays at a 45 plus. I need to like do a little more cardio, you know. I love how early the sun rises in the summer. But anyways, um, oh my God, my hair is sticking to my back, yuck. Oh, I hate that feeling. Um, I just, you know, summer, more cardio. I was just feeling it. So I've been going to the Fridays, but anyway, headed home now, but that one was like really rough. And <laughs> One of the coaches, her name's Amanda, I really like her. She came up to me in the middle of the class and she's like, are you okay? You look pissed. I was like, um, that is just a horrible case of RBF. I am so sorry. I don't know what to do about that. Nine times out of 10, not mad. Just have no uh, positive facial expressions while not paying attention. So anyways, it was just kind of funny. But good morning. I'm glad I got that done and over with. And now we're gonna carry on with the day. I just got back home. I'm just gonna wash my hands really quick. That woke up in the middle of the, uh, the night last night. Then came in bed with me and Colin. So I'm wondering if she's still sleeping or if she's awake. But we need to go assess the situation. <laughs> This is a happy little train. Her cars were filled with toy animals, and giraffes with long necks, and teddy bears with almost no necks at all. Oh, Okay, sit down. Okay, can you go put this in your dirty hamper? Oh, okay. Thank you. We're gonna wash him. Okay. Downstairs. Good job. Can you go all the way? Downstairs to the laundry room, put it in. Oops. 
Good job. Good job. Can you get it? Here, can I help you? Look. In here. Baby. Good job. You can go on an airplane? You are. Crazy, right? Um, I got a new flavor of my greens and I had to share with you guys. Blue raspberry from 1UP. I haven't put it in the other container yet, um, but this is what like the whole container looks like. This is what I drink every morning with my Armra, which I have, I'm on my like third of my Armra. So good. Started making Sutton breakfast and then she said, no, 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 pretzels. So she's just eating some pretzels right now. Are you going to be so in a good mood today? <laughs> I love you. Yeah, You're the cutest baby I've ever seen. What's that? What's what? That's my zipper. <laughs> Pretzels! But yesterday morning I made a breakfast burrito and it was so good, so I'm gonna remake it today with whatever we have. We have to go to the grocery store, seriously, so bad, but I'm gonna, you know, try my best, so. Burrito assembly, so I have a tortilla, um, scrambled eggs with cottage cheese, just like cooked together. I don't really like cottage cheese, so that's the best way to do it for me. And then sweet potatoes, and then I got my sausage. Just a little, little bit of cheese, nothing crazy. Then I just toast it. Okay, kind of a fail. I just need bigger tortillas, but here's the burrito, and then I did a side of sweet potatoes too. Okay, we're doing smoothies right now. We've been waiting for the pool guys to get here. They were late today, so I'm glad I didn't. Well, I don't really want to train them directly, but they've been here for like 45 minutes. We'll just have to run our errands after nap time. In the meantime, we're just drinking smoothies and watching the pool guys. Essentially, when the pool guys were leaving, because I told them that I was putting her down for a nap because they were still here, and asked if they needed anything, and they were like, no, we'll just start seeing you for your like regular routine, like pool maintenance. And I was like, oh, so we can swim in it now? And they were like, yep, it's like completely ready to go. And I was like, oh my god, amazing, awesome. Like, so fun, we'll have something to do. So I had to fill it up because you had to, I had to put more water in it, first of all. And then um, turn the pump on. Now we have like two hours before we can swim. So I'm putting my bathing suit on now, so I'm all ready to go. So all I have to do is get set and ready because um, she's still sleeping. However, I kind of heard her mumbling, so she's probably like waking up. But what I'm thinking is we'll swim tonight and we'll just do like Chinese takeout. Oh no, I do hear her. Okay. Well, if my freaking pony would work. I need coffee so bad, but in between like now and the two hours, I want to run to go get coffee, run to the UPS store, and I guess we'll just do the grocery store tomorrow at some point. Why did that just happen like that? Two hours. Less than that now. That's all you have to do. That's all you have to wait is two hours, and then guess what? Are you gonna jump in the pool and go swimming today? Have you been waiting for months? I know you have. And and you wanted to go swimming today, right? Want to go swimming tomorrow too? And the next day? Murph? You've got leaves on your tail. But I did not see before we got up here. Okay, do you want to hear the game plan for today? Or for the rest of the day? Do you want to hear my game plan? No. Okay, do you want to go in the car oh, no. and run an errand? <laughs> and then get coffee for mom. And then we'll come home and we'll get ready and we'll go swimming. Do you want to go swimming in the pool? What color shorts do you want? Light pink or hot pink? Pick. Pick some shorts. Can you grab a pair? 
Hot pink. Okay. This takes up from last year, so it's a little short, but that's okay. Oops. Here, I'll put that in here because we don't need it. Because we're going to put our shoes on. <laughs> Say your burps. No, you had it right. Your right foot. Can you say right foot? Right foot. Someone's getting their lawn mode. Okay, come over here, do your left foot. Just hold on to me. Here, come hold on to me. Left foot. Okay. I said. Yep. In the car first. We're gonna go in the car. We're gonna go to UPS. We're gonna go to Starbucks. <gasps> It's Friday, so do you think you want a cake pop? A cake pop? Yeah? Yeah. Yes, please, Mommy? Yes, please, Mommy. Okay, do you think you can give me a hug and a kiss before we go? Aww. Say, cake pops. Cake pops. Cake pops. From Starbucks. Simple. Say woohoo! 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 Are you ready? Hi. hi, baby. Who are you saying hi to? Thank you. Aside from the forget the filler from Lawless, because that's my favorite, I wanted to show you guys my like current favorite lip gloss if I can find it. It's the say. Oh my god, it's almost out actually. Say, glossy bounce and dip. This is my favorite gloss. A bit. Oh, did you see a bird? Really pretty and really natural looking. Thank you. Okay. Whoa. Murphy? Not Murphy liking it. I have to keep an eye on him. Whoa. She said, whoa. Murphy. Murph. Murph, that was wild. Lick my hand. I forgot to record the UPS interaction, but all they did was come scan my barcode and take my box because it was just an Amazon return. So, yeah, we're gonna head literally the most simple outing ever it took 10 minutes wow those are so cute i love them cool sit down sit down on it sit down can you sit like a chair sit like a chair okay Really quick, I've had this vision in my head all day of layering these two necklaces, so I just wanted to like see the vision come to life. It's so cute. 10 out of 10. Okay, are you guys not so obsessed with them? Like, I'm so obsessed with these. We're like half trying to get the chairs clean and half playing, but those two are done. And those are the old cushions. So, Dad just got here too. It's taken me a minute. <gasps> Sent to grab set and swimsuit for the pool. Man, it's like six o'clock. Colin just got home, but never, never too late for a little swim sesh. I think I'm gonna do this swimsuit just because I want to save her lemon one for our vacation, and then grab swimmy. Okay, we had to get her a new life jacket, but I sent it to Minnesota. So we have it there and we'll bring it home with us. So she has this one from last year that we didn't end up using because I know that the floaties aren't good, but that's all we have right now. So that's why it's on her. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! You okay? I got you. Here's Murphy. Whoa! There he goes. Give me 
gotcha. Look, 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 there's your bee swimming in the water. You see him? He's swimming in the water. Look, whoa. <laughs> We ended up doing the Chinese. So that's not wearing clothes, but say, mmm. We have solid core. I'm getting ready for that. Just finished. So rough. So rough. Okay, guys, we've cleaned, I've showered, I've done my hair on a time crunch, you know, so trying to get things done. The weirdest thing happened, and I ordered this backpack off of Walmart because I thought it was so cute for Sutton for our little plane ride. We can put her snacks in here and some toys, and I think she'll just be really into it. It'll keep her occupied on the plane. Well, it showed up from Walmart, mind you, in a Zara desk bag with a Zara tag. And... It's just kind of crazy to me that this little backpack was on Walmart for $8 and it came with a Zara tag. Isn't that weird? I just think that's kind of weird, but I'm not complaining like that's really cool, but it's kind of weird. And it also took two weeks to get here, which is also weird because Walmart ships so fast, which is why I get things from Walmart. But anyway, I just curled my hair. I'm about to brush it out. I just think that that's so weird. Like, I have to make a TikTok about this. It's crazy. Before I go do my makeup, I'm going to show you guys the dress that I ordered for our anniversary date, which I'm so excited about this. I feel like I'm going to have this in my closet for a long time. Okay. Cute. From J. Crew. Yellow flowy adorable oh my gosh i love it i didn't want to be like super fancy but i also didn't i like wanted to wear a dress but also i had just worn my jenny kane dress and i was like i need another like staple i feel like i need a few staple dresses like i would love to do a light pink one too can't wait to tell colin about this backpack yeah guess what i ordered this backpack for the plane from walmart it was eight dollars it came in a Zara dust bag with a Zara tag. In a Zara what? With a Zara tag. In a Zara dust bag. And I bought it off Walmart. And it kept saying like, shipment delay, shipment delay. It's like Walmart is DHK. Like that's basically what just happened with Zara. 
people are like, they sold that at Zara a couple months ago and it sold out. So I linked it on uh, Walmart. Mine was $8, now it's 11. Mine was like eight ninety, so I guess nine dollars. But if it says eight, oh my god, so clutch! And I was literally thinking they're gonna be here. Lexi's gonna be here. I'm already on top of it. I ordered backup remotes. How's your workout? It's good. It's actually really good. That's good. What'd you lift? I can't tell how to know where to pump up. I haven't been for so long, but I did just. Just now. The first day I go to the gym after the week. Is always chest and arms first, then back, and then throw them back and shoulders. Yeah, I was looking at these and I was like, what? Drop them? Like, okay. Mary. Am I supposed to peel? You know, I'm like not the, the most perfect plant person, but are you supposed to peel these back? Because I heard that flowers go bad faster when there's leaves in the water. I am making some overnight oats in case Sutton doesn't want to eat dinner tonight because she'll always eat these just to give them like multiple options on what to feed her, but I'll obviously like have dinner ready for her. But, um, yeah. I also can't wait to show her her backpack. Look! Whoa! Flowers. Yeah, flowers for Katie and flowers for mommy. Look, do you want to put this on? Do you want to wear it? so cute okay a little hectic a little chaotic but we're in the car and we're on the way yes finally and uh madison's parents got there and i gave them the whole rundown while colin finished getting ready um, yeah it was like the first time i was the one getting ready last. i know but that's okay because I, while i was doing my makeup colin was mopping the floor so we love a uh, a domestic king but <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Ah, but anyway, we're going to the chest stain. I'm wearing my new pearl necklace. Do you like the necklace? I do like it. Thanks. And Viva Ro Las Vegas. Yeah. Or Rock Vegas. Ro okay. Don't know what that is. It's a Flintstones is. reference. Kind of has a Flintstones vibe. In, a, in the best way. That's so embarrassing. <laughs> no, it looks great. I would just make it funny. Okay. Well, anyway, we're going to the chest stain. And I love their coffee, and the valet guy said great things about their dinner. Plus, I had a friend recommend it for dinner. So, we're gonna go try it out. It's beautiful, and I'm excited for Colin to see the chest stain area because I kept telling him about it, and I wanna go for a walk. Raving. One day. Raving. Raving. Actually. Also, this dress is so worth it. I will link. I hope that they still have it because Mary Ralph posted about it, and I was like, oof, thank God I ordered it before she did posted about it I mean because you know how it works someone posts it goes viral it sells out that's what happened I think I don't know it might still be in stock but J Crew, I have like found multiple things on J Crew's website that I'm like wait I want that but I haven't gotten them because self-control but no this dress is so cute so anyways we're on the way to dinner I wanted to make a TikTok and we didn't have time but that's okay there's always another day or we could just do it there a little outfit TikTok and I you know pictures and stuff I don't know but also we're getting there right as a reservation starts so maybe not <laughs> You'll never believe. Oh, oh, oh. 
this right now. Oh, you'll never believe. My rim. My whole rim. You'll never believe what he just did. It's kind of comical. It's kind of comical. This is what we're working with. That's everything we need. I have a spare tire, guys. Don't even worry about me. Cautious as you jet. I stood up. You know. Okay, now that the I don't know what to do. All right, he's got the tire off. I will say I am impressed. I also will say that he just admitted he watched a How to Change a Tire video a couple days ago on YouTube for no reason. I am calling this a self-fulfilling prophecy. Learned that in college, so if you don't know what it means, just go Google it, because that is what just happened, yeah. My best friend, Optimist Madison, said doing it for the plot. So that's, that is indeed what we're doing. We're doing it for the plot. But look, I'm backing away. Can you grab those, please, and hand them to me? The lug nut? Yes. Oh my god. Such a good partner. I'm a good assistant. Oh man. Here's your lug nuts. Do you one just want one at a time? Yeah. That's what I thought. Does this dress have pockets? No. It's okay. It's not a big deal. Oh, man. Okay. I would like to say throughout this entire experience, we haven't fought once. I do feel like this is a situation that couples could be in which would elicit a fight. Not once. Been in the best mood about this entire thing. One, because I just got so much content out of this. Two, I just sent a, a vlog to Colin's families that our group chat that we have vlogging the whole experience for them so we're bringing the vlogs into the family group chat because I just had to tell them what happened honestly and I will be driving home and probably everywhere from now on sorry Also, so many people have driven by us, and you know, there's one person who's asked if we needed help so far, and it was a really old couple, because that generation is like that, not our generation, no, 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 no. except me, I would be the one who, if I wasn't with Sutton, I would be the one to say, hey, can I help you? That is something very true about my personality, don't you agree? Mm -hmm. You just said, yeah. I'm just gonna. I'm literally Belle. And you're the beast. And you said you didn't have a spare tire. I didn't think I did. I've never seen it before. Probably because I don't run off the road and I've never had to use it before. Yeah, I literally found out when I was watching a video about how to change tire that pretty much every car comes with all the stuff you need to change a spare tire on the side of the road. Well, you know, I've literally never seen it before because. Well, I'm a good driver. I'm gonna start calling you Tire Daddy. Back again. A little star pattern. Making sure we have equal torque on the wheel studs. Well, guys, now my car won't start. For real. Okay, guys. We're home. Back home. So, my car wouldn't start. It was just crazy. It was crazy. I'll tell you about it. Picking up the vlog now because after we got everything situated, we were like rushing home to relieve Madison's parents of watching Sutton and put Sutton to bed. So Katie, Madison's mom, tried, but Sutton's just really difficult to get to sleep. So as we know. So anyway, um, my car wouldn't start. We called Colin's friend. He's at a wedding. Eric. We called Juan. He's like, okay, I'll be there in 25 minutes because he was 25 minutes from us. And we're like, okay. And then this really, really nice man named Charlie stopped and he was on his way home. He's like, I live right up the road. Let me go get my jumper cables. And he came back and he and his wife had just gotten back from dinner celebrating their wedding anniversary. And we were like, oh my gosh. 
and so it was very funny but I told Colin if we have a boy his middle name has to be Charlie like we're naming our first son after that guy he was so nice Charlie's a cute name too but he was so nice and just such a sweet sweet Georgia man <laughs> and <laughs> he saved our life so then we jumped our car my car tomorrow my car will be going to Pep Boys or wherever where are you gonna take it? I don't know yet. he doesn't know yet it, I mean like could not have been a more eventful situation good morning guys you wouldn't believe the morning I've had again so I just got back from solid core took Colin's car obviously we have to get my car fixed today lovely and Colin's car has no AC so driving it is just like miserable but grateful to have had his car to take to solid core then on the highway this morning on 75 driving from like Marietta down into Buckhead the Georgia State Police did the whole roadblock thing where they just line their cars up and don't let you go any further and I was late to my workout class but thankfully the coach Jordan like I kind of know like she knows who I am pretty much because I only take her class but um she was like I was a minute late it was fine like a minute late past the five minute late thing but Kyrie was in the class thank god and she told her what was going on and there was other people late so it was like other people were also stuck in the same situation but I just hate when they do that and I'm sure it's for a reason like I know that they're not like we're just gonna go sit in the middle of the highway and make all these people have like a road obstruction but when that happens and I swear it's happened to me at least like five times since we've moved here and it's always on like a Saturday or a Sunday morning and I just don't understand but today I googled it and apparently it was a like dot vehicle or a DOT vehicle something happened with it like a, a public transportation public transportation vehicle or something was moving really slow so they were trying to like avoid a bunch of traffic but then they caused a bunch of traffic I actually don't know how they work but they like to just block off the highways here all six lanes like we need six lanes because there's so many people here yet there's still traffic yet they're gonna block off all six like at least give us like two one I don't know anyways so I was late, I was stressed, then like my stress levels just went up again, you know, because I was like, okay, cool. Ended up making it, thank God. Took the class, but then the whole class I was just kind of like frazzled because I was so thrown off, like I was supposed to be 10 minutes early. So I just like to like take my time in the morning, you know. Anyways, it threw me off and then my class is weird and then I didn't go get coffee or anything after. So now I'm home. Because I was like, okay, I need to get home. So we can get my car fixed today. Uh, you want to go sit in the car with Sutton? Yeah. I'm just cleaning out the... There's so much, like, trash in here. Should I take this off? Okay, anyway. Um, I completely forgot, but Colin's having um, his friends over today to hang out by the pool. So we just dropped off my car. And I'm waiting for Colin to handle it. We had to get new tires. Can you say tires? Tires. New tires. <laughs> wow. Wow. Um, so anyways, they're coming over. His friends are going to get here at 2. So. <laughs> really today I just need to do laundry so it's all clean for our trip. Went ahead and threw on my bathing suit, showered really quick, got ready for the day. I'm gonna throw on a cover up. My bathing suit, I will link it because I think that they still have it. Shorts are a little wrinkly because I just washed them. But I just threw on a pair of jean shorts. This is like my little pool cover up. Colin's so funny. He got the whole backyard set up for his friends. The guys just got to the house and Colin ordered a pizza so I'm on my way to go pick up the pizza at Marietta Square I need to get gas on the way I'm gonna grab a pizza then I'm gonna grab a coffee from session stand because they're all right next to each other and then head back okay pizza I think I'm gonna do pizza then coffee so I can just leave because all it is is like a drive-through coffee situation you know 
Also, I'm in my car, obviously. Um, my car was done, they finished it super quick, but we were like the first car that they had today. Um, so we just took it to Pet Boys, and then when Colin's friend Juan got to our house, because Sutton's still sleeping, him and Juan ran to go pick up my car really quick. So I have my car back, I have a new tire and a new battery. Pizza secured. Okay, coffee, and then I'm ready to go back. Lavender latte. Okay guys, laid out the pizzas. The guys are all in the pool with Sutton. Is that not so cute? Look at Juan and Sutton. I love that. They are so old, my mom left them here. Press by the pool. It's not like she needs them, but anyway. And then there's like these little serving trays, which we have that corn dip still. Pizzas. What's so funny about all this is they're not going to care. They're just going to want food. So, love that. I stopped watching after like three episodes. It was like three in and I stopped. Flash, flash. Flash, flash. Good job. Come on, Tess. Come on. Let's go. Ready. Set. Let's go. Come on. Step. Uh -huh. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come Oh no. <laughs> okay, I'm just updating you guys. I changed into some Aritzia shorts in this Princess Polly sweater, but we're all going to get dinner now. We just had a fun little pool day in between me coming inside and doing laundry and stuff to prep for our trip and folding laundry. But anyways, we just changed and we're going to all get dinner at La Peria now. So I'm just updating you guys, okay? Like this is what is going on. I'm driving though, cause they're all have been drinking and I don't drink, so, cheers. <laughs> Went to La Korea, didn't vlog a thing. Honestly, first time ever, our service was kind of horrible. And now I'm just sitting here thinking about how much I have to do tomorrow and Tuesday before we leave Wednesday, and I'm getting stressed. I'm gonna start a new one tomorrow because it's gonna be like packing for a flight with a two-year-old. Stressed. And, yeah, I think it'll be fine now. I think it'll go well. I just need to download movies. I'm gonna write a to-do list right now that I'm like thinking all, all this stuff right now. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for being here. And I'll see you guys in the next one.